Are you Arrow? I'm not Arrow. This I want you to be Arrow. Well, thank you. I should. Hey, well, who do I talk to? <laughs> I talk to everyone. I, th I want to be Black Panther. That's what I oh, want. Oh, be yeah. Great. Jenna, say hello to Roger Cross. Hey, pleasure to meet you. Pleasure I mean, to meet you. This is the guy who was in 24, one of the oh, top shows of all. What did that feel like to be in such a hit show? It was amazing. I tell you, sometimes I, I really, literally, especially in season four and five, got the script, read the material, and was like, ooh, I get to do that. <laughs> it's like, it, was, it was great. It was a blast. It must have been. And um, did you enjoy playing a secret agent? I did. Oh, yeah. I'm not, I wasn't allowed to call my parents during that show. Is that so? Oh really? yeah, it's so good. <laughs> oh, it's a so wonderful good. show. Cheers and all to on a kind of him. Yeah, oh, here's all right, here's one. Cheers. Woo. All right, now that we covered that. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Well, you're Dad, doing. You're gone. also you're also doing continuum. Continuum. In Canada. Oh, this right. is so cool. Show, right? Yes, it's a great show. And basically, at first, it starts off in 2077, and basically, the corporations have decided. Let's get out from the shadow of the government because they really don't do anything. We really run things. So there's a corporation of North America. Government's out of the way. And they're a group of freedom fighters, we'll call them. Some may say terrorists, but I like to say freedom fighters. <laughs> that feel that people are, you know, been enslaved by technology and by these corporations. Are you a good guy or a bad guy? I'm a freedom fighter. Well, that makes you a good guy. <laughs> yeah, they all you. like freedom, I guess. <laughs> Who's unfreeing you that you're fighting? Uh, the corporations. The corporations are they, the bad guys. They're they're bad guys, and so they're they're basically capture the eight of us. We're the head of Liberate. They call uh -huh. us, and they're going to execute us. Do you, you know? get executed? Well, before yeah, we, a short do, show. it would be. <laughs> it's like that's it. It's over. No, <laughs> well, no, we would have been, but. A wonderful scientist that we have working with us finds a way to use the technology and the energy from the execution chamber to power a time travel device. We're supposed to go back seven years to try and stop things, but of course we end up in 2012 in Vancouver. They use Vancouver as Vancouver. And That's shocking. You know what I mean? <laughs> exactly. They never do. But the you know creator and writer said, why not? And well, there's no reason not to. Is there a lot Stop of action in the show? There's a ton of action. Yeah, um, a lot of special effects. Yeah, yes. A lot of is. fighting. A lot of fighting. Do you do any fighting? I do my characters kind of like really a thin, if scrawny guy like you. You do all that. Fighting. <laughs> no, it's true. Yeah. I gotta, That's I hard to, to imagine. Show. <laughs> <laughs> well, speaking of shows, you're also doing Arrow. Arrow is basically on the comic book Green Arrow, uh -huh. and so um, why don't they call it Green Arrow? Well, because. Well, there's actually the green and black arrow, correct? Mm -hmm. oh. See, so... <laughs> I think it's because they didn't do that well with Green Lantern and they figured, let's stay they away from, from the, the color green. green. Yeah. That's Very true. Unlucky. Maybe All that's right. what it is. Anyway, go ahead. Are you Arrow? I'm not Arrow. This... I want you to be Arrow. Well, thank you. I should... Hey, well, who do I talk to? <laughs> I talk to everyone. I think... I want to be Black Panther. That's what I oh, want. Oh, oh, yeah. Great. Ah, great. see, that's what. And, that and would I think be. they're going to start developing it. Really? Yeah. Well, you know, I you keep know, telling them that's, the next, that's the next one they've got to do. Tell me more about Arrow. Arrow, Arrow. Um, this wonderful actor, Steve Amell, who is, yeah, you talk about a guy that's in incredible condition and just yoked out and athletic and. Yeah, I can relate freaky. to that. Yes, I know you can. See, I've seen it. <laughs> working out. Hey, you but, hurt me. <laughs> <laughs> you know, he, he plays the arrow, and if you know people are familiar with the story, they'll know he gets shipwrecked, and he's on an island for five years, and a lot of things happen there. And he, you know, he starts off basically the playboy philanthropist. And uh, I, I, we have a character a little bit, just like a little that. bit like that. Yeah. I know. Tell me a little I, more. Yeah. Call our lawyer. So tell us about who you play. I am play. I play the character called Detective Hilton. He's partner with um, Detective Lance, the character that is um, the father of the Arrow's girlfriend. He basically tries to keep his partner on the straight and narrow, but his partner is kind of upset because of something that Arrow has done. And so he doesn't like this character, but he doesn't know he's the Arrow. No, but he doesn't like the, I see. the philanthropist, Oliver Queen. Somebody told me you were also in an X-Men movie. I did. But you weren't an X-Men. I wasn't an X-Men. Well, what the hell were you? I was, I see, I was filming this movie called X vs. Sever in Vancouver at the time. And um, Chris, who's also friends with Brian Singer at the time, said, oh, why don't you come over? We're doing X-Men right now. Come do a thing on it. So I was actually the president's bodyguard. 
and I was, you know, through the thing. Being, Did you guard him? Did he? Was he safe? He didn't do. I didn't do very well. Who would you have wanted to play? In X Men. Uh huh. Ooh, 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 ooh. There's so many different things. You know, you know what? I've always, I, I was, I, I was a fan of Beast. Ooh. I was a fan of Beast. I think. I, I like the Beast. I like oh, the Beast. Oh man. Awesome. Yes. No, no. I admire your taste. When I first did him. I wanted to go against type. He was the one who looked like a beast, you know? Yeah. So I wanted to make him the smartest one. Yeah. You know, just like you look smart, but you're not. You always go <laughs> against, you always go against types. This is where I come for lessons in humility, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> I come here for lessons in humility. You know, I only say that because I love you. I Aww. know, thanks. On that note, we have to wrap, but thank you so much for That's being it, I'm just getting I know, just just I got five it. more insults I can I heap at them. <laughs> <laughs> And I'm ready for them, okay? Hey, you're one of our best guests. You gotta come back again, but not too soon. Oh, God, not when too we, soon. When we have time. All right, let some other No, show. really, thanks so much. For Thank you for having me. And oh, lots well. of luck Thank with you. your career, although I don't think you need it. I think you're doing great. Well, just remember I'm available for cameo in anything you do. If you, I sw if you wanna do it, it will happen. Then let it happen and We'll see about the Black Panther. The more cameos, the closer certain ah, people get to the Black Panther. I like Panther. it. Uh, cheers to that. Cheers to you, my friend. <laughs> Thank you.